And you're very welcome to a more park here for the Lee Shopping Centre Senior Football Championship Round 2 clash between St. Joseph's and Port Arnton. The winner of this will go straight through to the quarter final. The loser will go into round three. Brought to you in association with Councillor Pascal McAvoy. Port Arnton have the first chance of the game. Ronan Coffey, the talented youngster from Port Arnton, lines it up and great score from Ronan Coffey. Excellent score. Tips it over with the right foot out near the sideline. Joseph is now on the attack. Michael Kyo gets the ball, turns around. Brian Daly coming through. And off his right foot, a great score by Brian Daly. His first today, Joseph's first today, and a great score. Brian Daly with a free on the 14 yard line. Easy tap over for him. Nice one to start off free taker with. Line ball given to Joseph's. Quick thinking by Michael Kyo. A great ball in into the mid big midfielder. Matty Campion turns onto his left, and great score from Matty Campion. Brian Daly with another free, even easier one this time. Centre the goal, tips over the bar, great score. Port Arnton on the attack. Adam Ryan on the 45, brings it through the whole way and tips it over the bar. Could have went for a goal there, but decided goal. Good score from Adam Ryan and Port's first from play. 13 minutes gone, Joseph's lead, four points to two. Dan Dunn lining up for his 45 metre kick off his left boot and great score. Excellent score from Dan Dunn, the goalkeeper from St. Joseph's. Free for Port Arnton. Jason Chilly Ward on the right hand side this time. Suits the left footer and he slots it over. Great score from Jason Ward. Five points to, tr five points to four. Ball comes out to Dean Brophy. The wing back gives it in. Matty Campen again off his left foot. Very accurate off that left foot. Matty Campen over the bar. Another point for Josephs. Another free for Port Arnton. A bit further out this time. Jason Chilly Ward. Same result. Great score from Chilly Ward. Matty Campen has the ball about 40 yards out. He goes past one, takes a solo, takes a bounce and puts it over the bar off the left foot again. Excellent score. Midfielders for Joseph's really doing damage today. Brian Daly, another free. Easy one for him. A man of his standards. Second half is underway. Joseph's lead eight points to five. Here comes David Murphy. Off his right boot. Great score from play from David Murphy. Really good point and that's exactly what Port needed. Brian Daly, probably the easiest free he'll get in this championship, slots it over the bar. Good score. Down the other end, Ronan Coffey. Excellent score again from Ronan Coffey. Sharp shooter. Long ball into Matty Campen. He turns, shrugs off his man, kicks, and a great score from Matty Campen. As Buff Egan would say, this man is doing untold damage today. Joseph's lead nine, 10 points to 7. Michael Kyo has the ball out in the terrace side of Moore Park. High ball in, dangerous ball in. David Murphy has it. No, he doesn't. Drops off. Dylan Dial buries it into the back of the net. Nothing Scott Osborne could do. Great goal. Joseph's lead 110 to 7. Free from Jason Chilly Ward. Easy one again. Taps it over the bar. Long ball in. Target man. Matty has it. Great ball over to his. Midfield counterpart, Brian Daly, tight angle and a super score. These two men have been incredible today. Really good partnership between the two midfielders. Ball breaks loose. Tom Kelly on the ground, gives it in. Michael Kyo running forward, cuts inside. Goal chance here, oh, and he buries it over the bar. It really should have been in the back of the net from Michael Kyo. I wonder did he think the point was good enough. David Murphy has taken over the free-taking duties. On the right hand side with the right foot, great score David Murphy. Tom Kelly has the ball out near the sideline, he cuts in, working his way through, hand passes it over the bar, excellent score from Tom Kelly, well he was reeling back the years there, back to his 2003 days, the Leash Leinster final. Another free for David Murphy, same result, straight over the bar. Maddie Campen has the ball out near the corner. Grey high ball in. James Kelly breaks it down into Tom Kelly. Tom goes for goal. Oh, what a save. Scott Osborne pulled off one of the saves of the championship. Point blank range. Excellent save. Tom Dunn, experienced fullback from Josephs, gives it into Ian Donnelly. Ian Donnelly hand pass over the top. Here's Brendan Hickey, full forward for Josephs, and he takes his point. Good score. He's first of the day. Referee John Flynn looks at his watch, blows the final whistle. St. Joseph's 115, Port 10.